Good morning and welcome out to Waymer Park out here in Huntersville, North Carolina, where today's feature is the Holbrook's Hellcats versus JJ Circus in green. Hellcats in red, of course. Rob Terabiti, volunteer referee, will drop the ball at center ice. It's the second period here. We got a 2 1 lead for green. We're going to bring you periods two and three here this morning. Thank you for joining us. Maybe today I'll keep the camera on the ball. Here we go, Justin Young in the corner against Kevin Meelan. See if he can create some magic, tries to wrap around, denied. Justin Silva the ball, back to Tom Ward with a slap shot that gets all the way through but goes wide. Jerry Luff first to get it in the corner. Cut on the swimble. James Forbes on the defense. And Mike Campbell steals it away and he's away. Two on three. Battle against Pete Specht on the boards here. Campbell loses the ball, Justin Young shielding. Oh, and a nice poke check by James Forbes because Justin is going to be in all alone. Because James continuing down the boards. A little physicality from Pete Becht. It's the best part of his game. Rob Cherubini watching the... Oh, now we got some pushing going on. Looks like a penalty coming to James Forbes. Pete wins it. Mike Steckler and Jaden touches it up. Father-son duo right here. And it looks like James Forbes getting the penalty. <laughs> Minor penalty to James Forbes in red, and J.J. Circus will go on the power play. First game, welcome Frank Santora. First game that Green has all been here. We got four full subs. So red will go shorthanded. Mike Steckler against Keenan Steckler. Another father son battle, and the face off dot. Jack wins, he's got time. Keenan Seckler blocks the pass. Brent Chaplin dumps it off, and Keenan will finish. No, nope. oh, it goes out off Mike Seckler. We'll get a face off. Got a 2 1 score here. JJ Circus in green over the Hellcats in red. Thank you for joining us on this beautiful Sunday morning, October 24th ish. I think it's the 24th. I got last week's date way wrong. Steckler back to Jack, back to Steckler. Back to Jack. Ah, and it goes all the way back. Goalie John Bergner will play it. And give a quick shout out to the youth program here. We got a couple kids. Hey guys. Yeah, give the camera some love. <laughs> there they are. <laughs> Tom Knox back behind the net. See how they break out here. Still on the power play. Just seconds remaining on the penalty. Just possessing, green possessing, spreading right out. There's a slap shot. James Hotchner, I think, got a piece of that. Might have been Kevin Meelan off his foot. Jack goes to play right at even strength here. Brent will dump it all the way down. No icings here in the CSHL. Tom Ward first back to play it. Dumped it to an open wing. Jack will dump it to an open wing over here again with Mike Steckler. Big shout out to Scott, who is watching here. He is the... A member of the Hellcats, we wish him the best of luck in his uh, pending surgery, I believe, a, a meniscus uh, injury, according to team doctors, for the Hellcats. He's on the Hellcats. Ooh, a quick shot by Keenan Seckler goes just wide. Ball gets thumped out to Jack. He dumps and chases. First to the ball, he's by himself, but here comes Jerry Luff right on the tape. Jerry Luff with a first shot, hot shot with a save, and the rebound goes just wide. Jack tries to wrap around, denied. Hotchner with a stick save from his stomach. And then Brent swats it away with a glove. Here comes Justin Young, best hands in the game. Gets denied though by Keenan Steckler. Mike Campbell loses the ball and Brent Chaplin retrieves and dumps it over to Kevin Meelan. He's got time. Shout out to Erin Fortenberry for tuning in. She was a member of last year's Charlotte Almost Winter Classic. We'll see if we see her again this year. Friendly reminder to everybody out there, Almost Winter Classic 2021, first Saturday in December, Saturday, December 4th. Pete Becht all alone with a nice shot. James gloves that down and we'll get a whistle. 2-1 score here. JJ Circus in green, red, uh, Hellcats in red. This faceoff will be between Jerry Luff and Keenan Seckler. Jerry wins it clean to Justin Young. Over to Pete Beck for the slap shot. Goes just wide. Justin battling with 
friend James Forbes. Now Brent Chaplin will challenge him. Back to the point. Tom Ward will be first to the ball. Jaden Steckler with a, a good four check. Red converges. James Forbes comes out with it. A shot and looks like it blocked by Pete. Ball comes down right in front of the net. Oh, that was shoveled just wide. Here comes Forbes and Beck battling again. We just had a penalty. Oh, that ball trickles out in front. John Bergner will jump on it. Scorekeeper Imran Faruqi shouts out. Three and a half minutes left and running. Got a 2 1 score here. Hey, boys, what team are we rooting for out here? Red team. Clearly, they want the red team to win. John Bergner covers them. Jerry Luff wins that face off. Green first to get it behind the net. Ooh, a little shovel play does not work on James Forbes. Oh, he gets poke checked though, stays, keeps the ball. He's being pestered on the boards. He recovers, gets a little space. That's all he needs. Oh no, bad dump. Over to Jerry. Jerry will recover on the boards against Mike Campbell here. Pete with a nice play, gets it over to Tom Ward. Tom's got time to gather it in and flip it, but Brent Chaplin with a glove pass. That should be, oh, good play by uh, Jaden Seckler not to play that, would have been a glove pass. Jaden shoots it just wide. Tom Moore at first to get the ball. Having trouble with it in the corner on the tennis court. Mike Campbell, ooh, he tried to go right in front, but he lost the ball. Jaden shoots it off the outside of the net. Mike Campbell all alone in the office behind, dumps it all the way down the court. We got some quick changes here while the ball is being retrieved. Red dumps it down, Jaden first to the ball. Pete cuts him off, however. He's got Justin Young. Here's a dangerous two on two here. These guys can score. He's blocked by James. Brent Chaplin first to the ball. Your Winter League 2020. I'm sorry, 2021? 2021 uh, MVP. John Bergner with a glove save. And a late whistle by goal, uh, referee Rob Cherubini. John actually did not have the ball covered, but it wasn't moving. It was frozen. A minute and a half left here in the second period. <laughs> now one. We'll give it time. We've got the third period action coming up. Keenan Seckler against Jack in the corner. Nice little battle. Always sounds a little worse than it is up against the fence. There's a ball. It took a funny hop. Gets behind John. And Keenan Steckler is fired up as he scores one. Stays with the ball. The Stecklers have family in from out of town. And they celebrate over here. Keenan gets on the board. And it's a 2-2 game. Who's winning? 2-2. It's 2-2. Forbes gathers the ball. Fakes a shot. Loses the ball to Jack. Justin Young. Oh, goes around Kevin. Kevin made a nice play to make him go wide, and Justin lost the ball. Justin against Kevin Nealon in the corner. Dumps it back to Tom Knox. He's last guy back. Jaden Seckler blanketing him. Gets a shot away, but it goes just wide. Justin Young still behind the net. Oh, nice pass to Tom Knox. Actually just chipped it over the net. Hit Steckler in the chest. Mike Steckler in the corner here. Going up against Kevin Nealon. Player starting to converge. We'll see who comes away with it. He dumps it out, but uh, Forbes will dump it the rest of the way. Bergner kicks the ball away. Red's got a 2 on 0. Steckler, the Steckler boys going against each other. Tom Knox dumps it away. Jaden with the shot gets blocked by Jack, and that'll be the period. Hey, Dad, I'm thirsty. We got a 2 2 score here out at, here at Waymer Park. This is game number two, the 9 30 slot between JJ Circus and uh, the Holbrook's Hellcats. We got a 2 2 score going into the third. Next game features the Hellcats. They'll go back to back against the black team, the Rough Riders. There's a Carson Steckler sighting here. There's a fourth Steckler with a Barkley. That's not Charles Barkley for all you fans out there. Saquon Barkley, star of the Youth Hockey League there. I'll give a shout out to the youth. Youth Hockey plays on Saturday morning. We've got 30 plus kids and playing in two different divisions. If you're watching this and are interested in signing up, 
We welcome you to comment, like, subscribe, send us a message. We're taking kids every day. The program is growing. We're currently in discussions with a couple different areas in and around Charlotte. Right now we're playing up in Huntersville right here at Weimar Park. Discussions to uh, expand our program, possibly in the Ballantyne area. Stay tuned for that. All right, bringing you third period action here. Hellcats and JJ Circus. Volunteer referee Alan Azali checks the goalies. Scorekeeper not ready, of course. It's Imran. He's not ready. Now he's good. Here we go. And third period is underway. Brent Chaplin with the ball. Dumps it down. Captain Jack with the ball, setting up in the office. Dumps it over to an open Steckler, and there's breakout for Green coming down three on two, but Keenan coming back. Oh, nice pass from Justin over to Jack, but nothing doing there. James Hodgson pokes it away. It's back to Jack in the corner. Jack looking around, back to Justin Young. Green with some good ball movement. There's a shot, goes just wide. Uh, former CEO, Lou Harbiton into the video here. I'm not sure, quite, quite sure how to do this. <laughs> Thanks for the comment, Scott. He says, being hurt sucks. Oh, hurt and old. Good job. And of course, Lou says, boo Mike Campbell. <laughs> so I'm trying to add you, if you can hear this, I'm bringing you into the video. My screen, my screen is blinking right now. Or the shot gets deflected just over the net. Jerry Luck behind the net, tries a wrap around. Ooh, Mike Campbell away though. Up against Tommy Knox with a nice block. Oh, a nice pass by Keenan. Gets caught in the feet of Mike Campbell and Tommy Knox is clear. Brent recovers though, Jerry Luck on him. Go poke check. Oh, a nice pass in front of the net and Brent and uh, Keenan Seckler just can't handle it. Shot goes into the corner. This is Jerry Luff against Mike Campbell. Jerry fans on it. Gets the jack though. There's Tom Knox. Plays it back and greens away. Ooh, a nice pass. Uh, Brent just stops that one. James Forbes over to Brent. Mike Campbell putting on a little four check. Not much happening here in the third period so far. I think Green will be okay with that. Although it is a 2-2 game. Tom Knox tries to clear off Keenan's back. Right there. Attempts. Does not go well. Tom Knox is clear. Brent over to Forbes. Jerry Luff. Good four check. Does not come over the ball though. Jack gives it away, but it falls on the Jerry left stick, and it's three on two. A nice little pass forward, and James sprawls to make the save. Jack tried to pull that to his backhand. James with a little poke check, and it fell underneath him. And the puck is frozen down. Five minutes left. Five minutes left. Five minutes left here in the third. We got a 2 2 score. This is Mike Campbell versus Justin Young. Justin, perfect in the dot so far today, I think. I haven't seen him lose one yet. Here's Pete Beck with a shot way wide. Steckler first to gather it in the corner, however. Lou says, let's try this again. Lou, look, see if you can join again. Let me see if I can add you. Uh-oh, we, we got action going on here. Got a little battle. Steckler and Chaplin going at it over there. Calm down, guys. It's all right. It's all right. Referee's straightening this one out here. A little fisticuffs. This is what hockey's all about. This stuff happens. Everybody's got an opinion out here. I think they'll be offsetting penalties. Referee's discussing in the corner. This was between Brent Chaplin and Mike Steckler. 
battle in the corner, and it looked like uh, both the players went down on top of each other. A little scramble ensued. Let's see if we can bring in Lou Hargerton to uh, get his opinion here. Lou, it says adding and it's blinking. My screen is blinking, so I don't know. The best, it says the guest declined to uh, the live video invitation. That's weird. I know what it is. Lou's probably operating on an Android. Hey, oh, hey there he is. Enough with the Android jokes. All right, jeez. <laughs> What's going on? Are you gonna help commentate here? Uh, if I can, you know, it's, uh, my eyesight's not where it used to be. It looks like, um, what's the score here? We got a 2-2 score between JJ Circus and the Hellcats. Ooh. And we're working out a little, uh, little altercation out here on the court. I saw Brent, like, you know, being Brent. Yeah, it was between Brent Chaplin and Mike Steckler. Yeah. Yeah, while they're while they're sorting it out, I'll just come on camera. Hey, look at that! Look at hey, we got the same got the same growth going on here. <laughs> it's time to start growing out the almost winter classic beard, you know? <laughs> winter classic beard. Yeah, maybe a mullet. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could pull off the mullet. I can't grow enough hair, I don't think. There's definitely a couple awkward, sloppy stages, but you just gotta grind through it, you know. <laughs> All right, we, we have the pool. captains gathered here with the referees. <laughs> working this we need a little selfie stick. Second hold. Let's see if we can get the call here from the referee. What does Zebra say here? What's going on? All right, here, let me see if I can translate. We got uh, Mike Steckler for a major penalty and a game misconduct. Ooh. And I haven't heard what they're giving to you, but, but I, I heard minor penalty. Let's see what they come out with. Huh. Wow. <laughs> What'd you get? What penalty? <laughs> Hi, Brad. Lou says hi. He's he's live with us. Looks like Brent has been given the gate as well. Any <laughs> 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 It's hockey. It happens. Looks like both of them got the gate here. Game misconducts. Let's see if anybody comes out with a power play here. That's fair, I guess. So it'll be a three on three. Is that how that works? No. It was a major. Oh, that would be fun. Over, yeah. Looks like a nice day four there on too. Four on three on three. Let's see what let's see what we got. Threes or fours? Three on three for the first minute. Ooh, three on three nice. for one minute. Nice. It sounds like. Three on three. Here's what we're looking at. We're looking at with the Howcats. We got both Steckler boys out. Uh, Keenan and Jaden with James Forbes on red, and then Justin Young, Tommy Knox, and Jack on green. Wow. This should be fun. A 2-2 tie yeah, in the third period. Yeah, we got some drama here. This is, this is good. Last I heard, there was five minutes left, so there's got to be uh, maybe three or four or something like that. Keenan going up against Tom Knox in the corner here. Good luck. I've done that a few times. Penalties and then game misconduct. Here's Tom Knox with the ball going up against Jaden Steckler. He's got time and room. Takes a shot. Yeah, takes a shot. The president shoot earlier. Oh! Jack with a little spinorama backhand, and James was fooled. 3 2 green. You know, uh, oh, it, it appears Brent Chaplin did not get a game misconduct. Ah.
just a major. I don't think that player should have come back on. If it's even even, a goal does not uh, a player does not come back on with a goal scored. Not for a major. Referee's going to straighten this one out here. Let's get it right. <laughs> just just want to get it right. I'm thinking uh, JJ Circus is a sentimental favorite today with uh, with the bench dedication, which I saw. Uh, yeah, should I get that on camera? <laughs> Referees are reviewing the uh, rules at this point in time. It was there was three on three. A goal was scored, and a player was brought back onto the ice. I'm not sure that's the correct ruling. Let's see if they get it right here. Rob will get it right. Oh, yeah, with, uh, with uh, JJ's bench dedication this week, I, I would yeah. think that uh, JJ Circus would be a sentimental favorite. For this yeah. Maybe JJ will be with him on this one. He's guiding it. This is kind of cool doing this split screen broadcast here. I like this. Yeah, I didn't know we could do this. I didn't either. I don't know. I think if, a little thing for people like it, but. Yeah, so hey, to, to those in the audience, if you're on mobile and uh, right beside it says write a comment, you'll see a little green icon. I forget what it actually says, but if you tap that, um, it should let you join in. I don't know if you can do more than one at a time. Probably not. Big phone, he knocks at the slap from 800 feet. Justin Young, I don't know if I got it on camera, but Justin actually deflected it at bounce, and he was about to have a tap in goal, and uh, Hotchner just gloved it down. I think that was, was that before I got on. I think I saw that one. Say that again. I think I saw that right before I got on. Yeah, good. Another whistle. I will tell you, Lou, my screen's a little skinnier in landscape view with somebody on here, so I actually have to pay more attention when I'm filming. Yeah. <laughs> I got to keep the ball in the middle of the screen. Yeah, you're on one by one now. <laughs> good thing it's a small court. Yeah, that's right. It's a power play right now. Uh -oh. There we go. We got a lot going on here. I, I, I don't, you know, you know, I don't envy the refs at all doing this. Yeah, I don't envy them. I refer, I refereed once in my life, and that was it. That was enough. <laughs> well, also, what I'm thinking is just going to back up the other games. Pickleball at 11 a.m. is just going to have to wait. Pickleball. A lot of pickleball going on out here, Lou. Yeah, it's a, it's a hot sport or activity. <laughs> Maybe we should do a Scarlet Street Pickleball League. We'll take a look at the Play. One minute left on the power play. One minute play. on the power play. Wow. Was that a two minute power play? That's great. Yeah, I think the major penalty. So major penalty is three minutes, and they were still serving, I believe. Oh, that one went in. Oh. Was that Mike Campbell? That was Boo Mike Campbell out there. Boo Mike Campbell. <laughs> Putting the team on his shoulders. This is exciting. What'd you say, Lou? This is exciting. What's the overtime rule? Yeah. Uh, so we go right to a shootout, a uh, three round shootout. Right, right to a shootout. Yeah. I would say that we favor JJ Circus, but not necessarily. What about JJ Circus? I would think that the shootout favors them, but uh, that's not necessarily. Yeah. Uh, true. You never know. Oh, yeah. We're going to look at the video to review what happened earlier. It's, uh, yeah, the, the wife of ejected Mike Steckler, Larry Steckler, is here in the booth discussing the earlier event, wanting to know what happened. It happened on the far side. I don't know how much we actually captured, but we'll have to go to the video review. You couldn't see much in the video from what I saw. Mike, are you bleeding? 
And Mike appeared to be first to the ball, had his back to the play. And uh, it, was, it was a physical play. He unfortunately had his head bumped against the boards and happened to be on a pole. So that's half the, uh, mm. the unfortunate nature of playing on a tennis court. But yeah. I'll have, have to take a look later. we got a minute and a half left here and a penalty coming up. Delayed penalty. Another penalty. Yeah. Whoa. I think it's Who's slashing back in that corner? Mike, how's your head? Mike, it's okay. 122 left in the game. 122 left in the game. 3 3. <laughs> <laughs> Is Brent, Brent whooping up the crowd over there? Yeah, we, got a, we got a good showing out here. Look at that. Look at it. We, we do have the Steckler, the Steckler family is in town. A lot of time. Crandall's way. Well, you know, they are. The Steckler family is like half the half the, the league right now. So. Yeah, half the CSHL is made up of Stecklers, correct? The S stands for Stecklers <laughs> and CSHL. We are fantastic people. There you go. We're yeah. a fantastic spin, family. Let's spin this around. Hey. hey. We're a fantastic family. Hey, girl. How are you doing? Well, you know, that's tough because that's my boys' team going against their dad. So that's, that's tough. Yeah. That's even, that's ooh, that's even better. Now, if you get a game, if you get a game misconduct in one game, can you play in the next game? That's a good question. We'll have to go to the rule book, I believe. I'm not sure. We'll have to. I need to use the club to play in two games in one day. But We've got a minute and a half left here. Time is running. We got a three-three game. Time will stop on the whistles though. Under two minutes. James Forbes, Keenan Steckler dumps it down to Mike Campbell. A little three on two down low. Mm -hmm. Green steals the ball. Justin Young, very dangerous. Puts one on James, looking for a rebound. Ooh. Looking for the tip. Mike dumps it off. Campbell steals the ball. Ooh, dumps it out in front of the Keenan Steckler. Very left on Kevin Nealon over to Ford. He's got some room here. Puts one on. A rebound. Keenan oh. Steckler. John Bergner made an excellent save. Oh. oh my gosh. Wow. I don't know how that stayed out. Looked like he had an open backhand. I wonder if John got a pat on it. Keenan with another try. He scores that one. Oh. What a big goal. Goalie throwing a fit. What a big goal. Got some drama. Huge goal. And to add insult to injury, the bench collapses on green. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what a game. Wow. I've only been watching eight minutes of this, and it's exciting. <laughs> we got a 4-3 game. Hellcats over JJ Circus. We got about a minute left. Both these teams need wins, too. Yeah. It looks like a penalty is being assessed to goalie John Bergner for throwing his stick at the goal. And Green will be in a deeper hole to dig out of with a minute left. Not much arguing from John. I think he knows. Here we go. Drop the ball. Four on three red. Let's see what I didn't the think that could have Did he like throw it to stop the, stop the play? Or stop the shot? What's that? Did he throw the... I don't know the interface. Did he throw the... No, it was at, to, at, after the goal in frustration, I believe. Oh, 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 yeah. 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 I believe there's only three seconds left in the game. However, Green has called the timeout here to draw something up. Probably pull the goalie here. Hey, you never know. Yep. One shot. <laughs> so who's up next? Try to discuss. Next game will feature the Red Hellcats. We'll be staying on the court against the Black Rough Riders. Ooh. That, be that good. game features league leading goal scorer and point getter Drew Swikas. Never heard of him. Who is <laughs> who is uh, taking his pregame hydration at this point in time? Yeah. <laughs> we all know what that is. <laughs> oh, no pass. Yeah, I know the guy. 
<laughs> but keep the fluids going. All right, the green net is empty. We got a three it second bump here. Justin has won every face off. So let's see. We got Jerry Loft teeing up right behind. Here we go. Okay, that's it. And that's it, folks. We're going to stay here through the handshakes and see if anything happens. <laughs> <laughs> Will there be handshakes? Goalie, uh, James Hutchin for a great game. There we go. And as a member of the Scorpions, a uh, big fan of this game because it didn't go into overtime. Both teams couldn't get points. <laughs> so, a victory for us. All right, Lou, as long as my phone has batteries, we're going to sign off here. I'm going to come back and bring you second and third period action between the Rough Riders and the Hellcats in a little bit here. Sounds good. All right, cool. I like joining in here. I'm going to go uh, do grown up stuff, I guess. <laughs> All right, have a good day. All right, see you guys.